Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. So a very different video. It's gonna be a more business video for you guys with my company. I'm the owner of a company called Runners Empire. It's an athletic apparel company. And I am at Dumbins Bennett High School in Kingsport, Tennessee. I'm here for the Crazy 8K and the USATF Men's 8K Championships. Very fast race. One of my favorite races of the whole year. I'm set up with my company. Uh, as well as I'll be running tonight. So I'll give you a little inside of kind of setting up the booth, things like that. I kind of love this race because, you know, with my business, I'm used to, I gotta check if my lights are off because I'm gonna be in here all day. Uh, you know, I like to do the big races. I have Chicago coming up, you know, I'm used to doing Flying Pig, things like this. But I kind of like the small races too. Camera yeah, turned off, make sure it's locked. I like the small races too, just because you can, wasn't locked. Anyway, I like the small races just because you can connect more with runners. Um, and it's more of a low-key show. And the best part about this show, because I've been doing this for like five, six years at this one, and I'm great friends with the people who put everything on. I'm the only vendor here. Uh, the only vendor. There's no, no one else selling merchandise, selling anything, except for like the Crazy 8K merchandise. So as a business, that helps me a lot because there's no competition at all um so yeah the show is from 12 to 8 i'm gonna go set up right now i unloaded everything uh they changed kind of where things are it's actually right by the start line start line's gonna be literally right there and this is a huge race like five six thousand runners it's nuts All right guys, got the booth completely set up. I don't know if you can tell, but it is absolutely pouring outside. So I just made it in time and was able to get everything situated. Um, so, so far it's not even show time and all the volunteers have been buying stuff like crazy. So, so far it's going amazing. I uh, just hope it stays this way and it's not just a, I guess, first hour thing, but I, I have a really good feeling about the show. Alright everybody, Jesus, this sun is bad. So just finished the expo. I know it's kind of all over the place, um, this vlog. I know it's been, it's literally been like, what, two minutes for you guys and like eight hours for me. Show went amazing. Uh, best show for the Crazy AK I've ever done. Uh, doubled my goal in terms of what I wanted to do for revenue. Awesome. Uh, feeling good. It's about hour and 10 minutes until the race i'm gonna start warming up and i'll take you guys kind of around if i can the festivities and stuff like that <laughs> USA Track and Field Championship battle was fierce as expected. That elite start went off just about 9 p.m. in some truly humid conditions, but it did not slow down Ahmed Muhammad as he came across the finish line with arms. <laughs> All right, everyone just checked into the room. You can see right there, got the metal. Trying to show it off when I was there, but it actually rotates, it's really cool. So just checked my official time, ran 29.52. I'm all right with it, personally. Like it was not my greatest race, not my worst. Um, I was just okay with it. Um, just, I went out too fast. 
I know I did because I tried to keep, when I crossed the 5K mark, when I set my PR last time, I was like 17.01, 17.02. So, or no, no, no. I was like 16.55 when I set my PR. So this course, I wanted to make sure to be above 17. Crossed the 5K in like 16.47. And I was like, ah, oh, shoot. I went out way too fast. Then like 3.75 miles in, I looked down at my watch and it said like 5.50 pace. And I'm like, it's over. It's over. Uh, so then, um, you know, in situations like that, you kind of got to go through kind of your goals. That's why it's important to set like an A goal. I, I, some people like to say, set like A, B, C, D goals. I don't like that. I like to set an A goal, a B goal, and then kind of your emergency goal. Um, but for this race, I really just had an A goal, which was PR. And my emergency goal was make sure to finish sub 30. Uh, which I did around 29, like I said, it was like 50, I believe, 29.51. So, yeah, overall, it was great. Um, but the expo was the main awesome point, especially, I showed you, there were so many people wearing runners on Pirate Singlets, which was awesome. I couldn't even film them all because there were so many. I probably saw 20 or 30. It was nuts. Um, so thank you all so much for the support. It was, it was awesome. This expo was my best for the Crazy AK, and I've done it seven years in a row. This was number one. Um, so, yeah. Now I get my break from running. Uh, I get a full week off, and then I go right into marathon prep. So I'm going to enjoy this week off and just relax and chill and probably sleep in. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below. Have you ever done this race? Uh, I always recommend it to everybody. It's a race worth traveling to. No matter where you're at in the country, it is worth traveling to. So if you have any questions about this race, please let me know. Anyway, guys, I will see you on the next one.